The term sowing is used when seeds are sown directly into the prepared area or nursery pots or bags. Sowing seeds need a different soil condition and environment for proper germination. The depth of sowing and the management practices while handling seeds is considered risky. Plants grown directly from seeds have a long cultivation time period. The term transplanting is used when seedlings from the nursery are moved into the main farming area or final growing area. The soil conditions and environmental factors for seedlings should be prepared properly to avoid loss and root damage. Seedlings or saplings obtained from trusted nurseries can be handled easily by maintaining better farm practices. In other words, transplanting and sowing are two important processes in gardening and agriculture. While they both involve planting, they differ in several ways. In this video, we will explore the differences between transplanting and sowing, and when each method is appropriate to use. Transplanting is the process of moving a plant from one location to another. This can involve moving a seedling from a nursery pot to a larger pot, or from a pot to the ground. Transplanting is usually done when a plant has outgrown its current container or when it needs to be moved to a different location for better growth. Sowing, on the other hand, is the process of planting seeds directly into the soil. This can be done by scattering seeds over the soil surface or by planting them in rows. Sowing is usually done when growing plants from scratch and can be done indoors or outdoors depending on the plant and climate. One of the main advantages of transplanting is that it allows you to control the growth of your plants more easily. You can choose to transplant your plants when they are small, allowing them to grow bigger and stronger before being planted outside. This can help improve the chances of survival for your plants, especially if they are delicate or require specific growing conditions. Sowing, on the other hand, is ideal for growing plants that are adapted to the climate and soil conditions in your area. By planting seeds directly in the ground, you can take advantage of natural environmental conditions to help your plants grow. Sowing is also a cost-effective way to grow plants, as seeds are usually less expensive than seedlings. In conclusion, both transplanting and sowing are essential techniques for growing plants. Transplanting allows you to control the growth of your plants and improve their chances of survival, while sowing is ideal for growing plants that are adapted to your local environment. Knowing when to use each method can help you achieve the best results in your gardening and agriculture endeavors.